take a look at your screen. Perhaps you've seen this little guy. He's got viral canine controversy. He did go viral this week after his courtside appearance at a Miami Heat game. Look familiar? Now his owner, though, is facing a county fine for having the dogs fur colored. Absolutely. Here's NBC6's Alina Machado. The South Florida Pomeranian went viral after showing up courtside at a heat game Monday. It's, it made NBA history because nobody's ever seen a Pikachu dog uh, sitting next to an NBA player uh, before. But it's Pikachu's fur collar that is now making headlines. The dog had already gotten the attention of Miami-Dade Animal Services during an inspection at his owner's Doral Puppy Store on December 21st. Pikachu was in the store. Uh, there was a, a staff member holding the dog uh, on her lap. And we obtained a photograph at that time. Kathleen Labrada, assistant director of Miami-Dade Animal Services, says there's a county ordinance saying it is unlawful for any person to possess, sell, or otherwise transfer within the county any dyed or artificially colored rabbit or other animal. So on December 28th, a few days after the initial inspection at World Famous Puppies, the county told Eric Torres, the dog's owner, they would be issuing a citation. No animal should be dyed, regardless of whether there's an ordinance prohibiting that or not. You don't really have have any any guarantee or any assurance that the um the chemicals they're putting onto your pet are safe. Miami-Dade Animal Services says they have issued 16 citations against world-famous puppies since they were licensed in March of last year, with many of those citations stemming from complaints alleging the sale of sick dogs. Eric says he does what he can to keep the dogs healthy and disputes the allegations. Puppies are very delicate. Uh, they do tend to have very low and weak immune systems as they develop. Uh, so it is the nature of the business that dogs do get sick. Pikachu, Eric says, is his family dog and is not for sale. Here it is. It's a dye. You can eat it. He tells us he bought a bottle of the dye and maintains it is safe enough for him to eat. He plans to appeal the citation. Because at the end of the day, I had no idea that this ordinance even existed. He also says he is staying outside of Miami-Dade County for now. You're not allowed to have possession of it, so it's been kind of freaking me out. Miami-Dade Animal Services tells me at this time they have no plans to remove the dog from Eric. The citation, by the way, carries a fine of about $200. Alina Machado, NBC6 News.